February in America. It's like a goddamn national holiday today. What's the date? February... February 7th, 2016, we're an hour and 20 minutes away from Super Bowl 50. This is football in America. Egg, what do we call it? Hand egg. Hand egg is what it is. Denver Broncos, Carolina Panthers. I can't really say I'm like a diehard sports fan at all. I'm a casual observer, but growing up where I did, we don't have any professional sports teams or anything. And I just think it's kind of silly. The Vesper got nerfed and that has nothing to do with how terrible my shot was. I'm not warmed up right now. But anyway, like I said, I've never been like a, uh, a huge sports fan. I don't really call myself a, I'm a casual observer, like I said. In high school, my best friend was always a, uh, a huge fan of Tom Brady and the Patriots. And I was a huge fan of the Colts and Peyton Manning, who's competing today in the Super Bowl under the uh, Denver Broncos organization. I just, I still to this day don't like Tom Brady. He's just he's too fucking perfect. What is in my ear? Is that a bug? That was in my ear, bro. He's just like too perfect of a person. Like he... Fucking wins everything. He's like super athletic. Just got gorgeous locks of hair. Fucking like has sex with supermodels whenever he wants, I'm sure. It's just not cool. Peyton Manning, on the other hand, you know, he's kind of tall, awkward looking, lanky. Got a big ass forehead, sponsored by a pizza place. But he still gets the job done. You know what I'm saying? That's my kind of guy right there. You know, he overcomes the odds and he's still successful. You know, he's down to earth. You can't be sponsored by Papa John's and not be down to earth. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, yeah, I guess I'll be rooting for the Denver Broncos tonight just because Peyton Manning is playing for them. But I probably won't even tune in until, like, the second half. Like I said, it starts in, like, an hour and 20 minutes. I'm going to the gym, though. This is not really, like, a national holiday for me. Like, I'm not going to go out and stuff my fat fucking face with just stupid amounts of junk food. Pizza, nachos, hot dogs, beer, chicken wings. No thanks. I'm going to squat and have a kale shake afterwards. Because I'm a real man. Because I just like, one side of me, you know, maybe it's my left brain. Or my right brain, I don't really... Oh my, what the shit. Like, I just can't tune into like a big sports match and it never crossed my mind how ridiculous it is that people are so passionate about these grown-ass men just playing games. Now look, I'm not going to say what I do because I'm working right now. I'm not going to say my job is important or anything, but I also don't take myself too seriously. You know what I'm saying? But people get like legitimately upset over sports and it just, it blows my mind. Like I don't understand how we got to a point where like these people are just, well, I mean, they're celebrities. You know what I'm saying? They're just on the biggest pedestal you could think of. It like, it drives me to the point of looking up the similarities between the ancient Roman empire and the current state of the United States of America. Because back in ancient Rome, you know what I'm saying, they had a, a crazy empire. They were running shit. I'm not going to say the United States is running shit, but we're running shit right now. But I always think about, like, when the United States will fall. when this, Because it will happen, you know what I'm saying. It is going to fall. And what are some of the similarities to how ancient Rome, you know, was in its late stages? And one of the things was, like, the gladiators... You know, back then, that was their sportsmen, and they were put up on a really high pedestal. They were treated just like celebrities today were. They were very highly paid. They were taken care of. <coughs> oh, God, my voice is still a little fucked up. Women were flocking over this men. I actually read a piece that said women, you know, they didn't have access, like the groupies, the gladiator groupies, didn't have a lot of access to the gladiators, similar to how, like... You know, a girl would to a football player now. she just yell from the stands or go to the after party or something. They used to pay to go to the gladiator's cell and have them fuck them. Like, have the gladiators fuck them. <coughs> like, I'm not saying being a gladiator was terrible. It seems fucking awesome. Unless you got killed or something. But. Damn, can I get into, like, a real game? But yeah, with how, like, obsessed, you know, the Roman Empire was with the gladiators and their sportsmen and how they just kind of, like won the hearts of the country. These were like the late stages of, uh, you know, the Roman Empire, just really excessive wealth. Like there was no middle class, you know, inequality between social classes. Like that's the shit I think about when I tune into like a football game. Like, I don't know. It's just how my brain works. I don't get it. And it's like, I want to say, don't y'all want to worry about some real shit or something? And then I just come on Call of Duty to talk about it. <laughs> and this is like even worse. Like, I played video games for a living. I kind of still do. So, you know, I definitely don't have any room to talk. I'm just saying, I don't take myself as seriously. What the fuck? Oh, shit. What was that? Oh, whoa. Dude. 
That was a fucking massacre. Yeah, anyway, all I'm saying is, I just think it's strange. I'm still going to watch the Super Bowl. Like I said, I'll tune into the second half. I hope Peyton Manning takes it home. You know, I just, I also hope that we think about the similarities between, you know, the fall of the ancient Roman Empire and the current, you know, modern day United States of America. Because shit is coming, bro. Anyway, happy National fucking Super Bowl Day. Have some fun. Take a break. Get ready for the week tomorrow. My voice is coming back. <laughs> Thank God. And I'll catch y'all tomorrow. If you did enjoy the video here today, be sure to leave a like. If you didn't, just refresh it and give it one more chance. And as always, guys, I don't really have enough. Ooh, goat sack, boy. You played yourself.